from the new series, Dr. Odyssey, Joshua Jackson. Plus, fantastic ball bargains, exclusively for our amazing viewers. Also, a guide to fall apples as we wrap up our fall into the season week. Good morning, Friday, September 27th, 2024. Woo, we made it, we made we it. We did it. It's Friday. We did it. Mm. What mm. women find sexy? Oh. oh. Where'd we get this from? Let's see. Is this from People Magazine? This is uh, the, inter the internet. Oh, from the internet, so it must be true. True. Listen up, ladies. All right, top reasons why women find men sexy. When you pay attention to how you're dressed. Oh, that's true. Yeah. You always look fetching. Thank you. I thought it meant when we pay attention to how you're dressed. Yes. Oh. <laughs> no, no, this is how men dress. When yeah. you pay attention. When men pay attention. Yeah. When they take care of themselves. When they try. When they try. Yeah, I do, I do love sweatpants, though. But you love sweatpants at sweatpants time. That's sweatpants time. You don't love sweatpants going out no, to dinner. No, 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 no. Um, mm. <laughs> uh, when you say you're right without a qualifier. <laughs> you're getting less sexy as this article goes on. You're r r r r r r r r r Even when I'm demonstratively right, he can't admit that I'm right. There's always a caveat about how I'm in some way wrong in the rightness. There should be one to say when you're wrong, you admit you're wrong. I do that. Sometimes. I do that. I do that. Do that. Uh, when you're good in the kitchen. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I mean, I'm not that good. In the, I don't really do it. I'm, I'm good on the grill. You're great on the grill. You're great on the grill. And that makes up for all of the kitchen that you don't do. <laughs> Stuff. Stuff. Did I say the S word? Yes. <laughs> you're right. Oh my God. You're right, Kelly. Yeah, you did, you did say it, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when you genuinely love animals. Uh, yeah. You love your animals. I do, I do. Uh, when you make the bed. You do make the bed. You bounce a quarter off that yes, thing. Yes, you are with military accuracy. Yes. When you dance, even if it's kind of goofy. I love when you yeah, dance. Yeah. Yes. When you read. Well, I listen. You listen. <laughs> I never thought that I would spend my adult life, like my older adult life. I knew as an adult I would read bedtime stories to my children. I knew that. I knew that going into it. But I never dreamed that as a 50 plus year old woman, I would be reading books aloud to my husband. <laughs> That's only happened a couple times, but I listen to, I listen to the audible books yeah. Yeah. because it's hard for me to read. Um, when you smell nice. You usually smell I nice. I usually smell nice. Yes. When you brush or play with her hair. I don't brush your hair, that's weird. You don't brush it, and you <laughs> seldom play with it. No, because it's always done, it's always perfect. I don't want to like, you know, but I do, I do from every, every now and then, I'll, I'll just do something like that. <laughs> <laughs> that's like second base at our house. Uh, when you really listen. <laughs> really listening is the greatest thing. It is. Yes. It is, you're right. Um, when you respect people who are serving you. Oh, like a waiter. Yeah, yeah, yes. 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 Yeah. Yes. That's not sexy. That is not sexy. No. Anybody that is rude to a waiter. Yeah. That is like, it's it's like if you want to if you want to get into what a woman finds sexy, treat people around you with dignity and respect and kindness, 
and you'll see all sorts of undergarments fall off. <laughs> Am I right? I mean, it's like, it's a window into the soul. That is. Uh, so this is a really interesting article, and it's kind of counterintuitive to what I would believe. Um, it says, this article is titled, okay, my zits seem to go away faster when I wear makeup. Is that possible? Mm -mm. So I think the answer would be no. And it, I, I even, I mean, I don't really get zits anymore, but when I did and I would have to put makeup on them, you know, for work, it drove me crazy because I felt like I was prolonging the agony and making the right. zit, like, extending its life right. almost. But they're saying that a... Uh, Acne sufferers are taking to TikTok. Is this a TikTok article, uh, yeah, Galman? Of course, they all are. Oh, so the doctors yeah. from TikTok are weighing in? Yeah. <laughs> They're saying applying full glam daily makeup seemed to make their skin somehow better, so they asked an actual doctor. To be clear, it's unlikely that the makeup is magically healing your acne, but it has an indirect benefit because you probably touch your face less when you have makeup on. Right. You are less inclined to squeeze it, pick at it, right. play with and it. And hopefully you're washing your face. And that's the other thing. So when you apply makeup, mm. you tend to be more thorough in the and cleaning cleansing of your face. Right, right. Yes, yeah, so there's, okay. that is the okay. reason. So don't avoid makeup. Don't avoid makeup, okay. I guess. All right, is the public service announcement. Public service announcement. <laughs> Hey, a 10-year-old girl who got lost in the woods while sleepwalking is found by a found safe by thermal imaging drone. I Truly saw this. a miracle. Peyton um, Santignan went missing, oh my gosh, uh, near her home in Shreveport around 10 p.m. September 14th, uh, and they found her. Look at that image. That is crazy. Isn't that wild? Yeah, that is crazy. She was um she was located, they found her in the fetal position on, uh, in the thick woods about 20 minutes, at, uh, within about 20 minutes after the drone took flight. But she was missing uh, about, she went, she walked about a mile and a half away from her, from her home. Hmm. It's really. I, I, mean, I can't imagine. It's so terrifying. Yeah, and they found her over 24 hours later. It's, right, Mike, that's, that must have been the longest 24 hours of, of this family's of life. Of the family's life, for sure. Yeah. For did, sure. Our kids never slept, walked, did they? Maybe the youngest did a couple times. We were like, are you awake? Yeah, he definitely would. Yeah. He would definitely. I wouldn't say. Did you, did you ever do that? No. Me neither. Mm -mm. I wouldn't say he slept walk, but he was like definitely groggy. He would and groggy when, walk. And then wouldn't remember. Like, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's good news. I'm remember when he it. ate the roof off the gingerbread house? Yes. Yeah. He would eat. He would. With this really pretty gingerbread house and in the morning we would come into the kitchen and it looked like a raccoon had gotten to it <laughs> and every day we would ask the kids we would ask the older two kids uh did you eat this and they would say no and he was too little you know there was no way he could reach it so we knew it wasn't him and then didn't you set up you set up the camera mm -hmm. Mark set up uh, the the camera in the kitchen, and sure enough, you see Joaquin sort of like walk out, like pulled you know, chair. he was like a to like a toddler, and he uh, pulled a chair, climbed up, and was like just sitting there eating the gingerbread house, and then he would put the chair back and go right back to bed. Yeah, it was wild. So I would nice. call that like maybe sleep, sleepwalking, sleepwalking think, sleep yeah. eating, yeah. something like that. Um, so you know, we've been talking about. Halloween and mm. whether or not I should decorate the house for Halloween. It's not for a lack of love for decoration, decorating and Halloween. I love all of it, but like I said, there's a lot of construction going on in our neighborhood that is making it sort of difficult. Article in the paper is talking about is Halloween getting too scary for kids because a lot of people are decorating their houses in really ghoulish and terrifying ways. Yeah. It's getting violent. And so they're saying that Halloween is getting scarier and scarier as retailers like try to outdo each other. You know, like technology is also making right. it easier for these things to move around oh, a little yeah. bit. It's right. pretty graphic and, and realistic. Yeah, yeah, so there's a lot of images on social media that uh, of people's like terrifying displays and it's really getting like there are it, there's terrifying kids maybe that's part of the 
point, point. they don't necessarily want the kids ringing their doorbell. <laughs> so maybe that's why they're... But we had those when we take the kids. Some of the, some, some of the displays were pretty scary. The kids didn't want to go. That's kind of like the, the fun of it. I, I don't remember anything that scary. No. Uh, hey, we've got a huge show today. Joshua Jackson is here. Yeah. And we'll share some fantastic fall beauty bargains. All for 50% off. And we wrap up fall into the season week. Gosh, I can't believe we're wrapping it up already. It seems like it fall just, just started. <laughs> we've got social media star Shannon Doherty here and a complete guide for what we should do with our fall apples. Yeah. yeah. Also... Um, there's a bit of a, the, the Buccaneers play the Eagles in Tampa this weekend. Oh. So I think Ashley and I have a oh, little bit of a bet. Oh, what's your bet? Yeah, what's the bet? We were going to, I was going to, if, if the Eagles win, I would have to eat a Philly cheese, Philly, Philly cheesesteak. Yeah, but that's like a reward for you. And, um, <laughs> and if, uh, if the Bucks win, you have to eat. Yeah, what's uh, the story, Ash? What do you have to do? Say wings. Eat wings from Hooters. We'll, we'll figure it out over the weekend. We'll figure it out over the weekend. You'll see something on Monday with one of us. <laughs> you probably, Ashley, we doing wearing a Buccaneers yeah. paraphernalia. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Uh, stay tuned for Monday. We've got a lot to look forward yeah. to. Okay. All right, it's the moment you've all been waiting for. It's time to play. <laughs> Let's say hello to Christine Painter from Rochester, uh, Minnesota, who watches the show on KAAL. Good morning, Christine. How are you? Good morning, uh, Mark and Kelly. I am great. How is the weather there in Minnesota today? It's, it's beautiful. It's like in the 60s now, but it'll get up to the 70s. It's sunny and it's really nice. Are the leaves turning? Um, a few of them. A Just few a few of them. them. But before we start, I just wanted to give a shout out to everyone at the show who put together that um, tribute to Art Moore last week. It was fabulous. Aww. I laughed, I cried. <laughs> it, was it was wonderful. Good. Christine says she wants to stump me so she can outsmart me. Oh, oh good. Yeah. All right. All right, Christine, you know how this game works. You give us two statements. One is true, one is false. I have 60 seconds to decide which is the truth. And if you stump me, you'll win this. Oh. And that. I Here like, are I Christine's like, two I like statements. one of these two statements. Um, I went skydiving twice on the same day. Or, mm -hmm. I have hiked the 310-mile Superior Trail. Oh, mm -hmm. wow. Okay, let's talk about skydiving. Um, have you, do you have you continued to skydive? Nope, those are the only two jumps I made. It was, I was at Michigan Tech for college my freshman year. They had a skydiving club. Oh. So I'd always wanted to do it, so I signed up and went out to the airport one day, took the training, and made a jump and then they offered to me a chance to go again so i did you said what the heck yeah okay and then that was it never did it after that no i always kind of wanted to but never really had the time or the money i guess got it got it okay tell me about this trail how long did it take you to hike this trail uh it took 32 days um i i got laid off from my job at ibm in 2020 and my husband was already retired so we just had some time on our hands and my husband had done hiking um, with our son and the Boy Scouts. I'd never done a long hike, but uh, he, my husband planned it all out, and it was beautiful. Yeah, wow, 30 can, days. Can you, can you um, just for my own personal interest, Christine, tell me, like, what the big takeaway is from doing a major hike like that? Uh, what's the thing that I would need or a good thing to know? Uh, you better have good shoes, <laughs> mm -hmm. comfortable shoes, and um, just enjoy the just enjoy the moment. It was beautiful along Lake Superior. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds great. Thirty days, thir three hundred and ten miles. Mm. Yeah, we averaged about we shot for ten miles a day. It's a lot of miles. Yeah, that is a lot of miles. Okay, um, I'm going to say you hiked the three hundred ten miles. You're wrong, Mark. Ah. Wrong? You are wrong, Mark. <laughs> I knew I was wrong. I knew I was wrong. 
I heard a guy over here grimace. He's like, oh, no. That's really wild that you jumped out of an airplane twice, twice in, in one day. day. They gave me $25 off the second jump, so I had to do it. Like, to me, that's a bad sign. I, I want them to, to, like, charge me double to make sure I come down safe. Well, Christine, congratulations. You won the mug. You won the T-shirt. Now let's see All if we right. can win you a valuable trip. It's time for Great Getaways Travel <laughs> Trivia. to see what else Christine is playing for. All right. All right, you're playing for... Oh, Ooh. oh, this is a great prize. Two nights at Walt Disney World before a five-night Disney Cruise Line vacation for four to the Caribbean oh on the all-new Disney Destiny. It includes oh all goodness. meals and spa access. It's a prize valued at $14,500. Wow. You have I 20 have seconds and only one guess. Good luck, Christine. All right, Christine, here we go. Earlier this week, Arthur Hanlon performed on the show. What did Arthur say the song Repetimos is the official song of? Zumba! Yes! Congratulations! You and three guests will enjoy five nights aboard the Disney Destiny, one of the newest ships from Disney Cruise Line. Heroes and villains will come alive as you journey to incredible island destinations. Watch beloved Disney stories come to life. Dine with the Lion King and much more. Magic and mischief will collide in action-packed kids' clubs, state rooms designed for families, and exclusive escapes perfect for adults. Embrace your destiny on board. Your prize is valued at approximately $14,500. Christine, we're so excited for you. That looks like a great trip. Little grandkids, so oh, I think they'll love it. That's awesome. Oh, perfect. All right, Christine, now you get to make the day of a lucky member of our studio audience who will receive a Roomba vacuum cleaner from iRobot. So please pick a number between 1 and 150. Uh, my husband and I have been married 37 years, so I'll say 37. <laughs> <laughs> Can they just speed that up? One of those couples were professional dancers, <laughs> and the other was us. <laughs> uh, on Monday's show, Liam Hemsworth will be here. And Felicity Huffman will be here. And a performance by D Gavin DeGraw. All right, get ready, everyone. He's a talented actor whose work includes the series Fringe and The Affair. The Affair, yes. come on. Now he's saving lives on the high seas in the new series, Dr. Odyssey. Please welcome back to the show, Joshua Jackson. <laughs> Way to enter. It is. Yeah. That was a good. That was yeah. a good entrance. You're gonna. You know, you we do an a big entrance energy, yeah. which we like. We do an award for the best entry of this. Of the oh, year. really? So oh, I think yes. you're gonna, probably going to be in there. Be in the okay. Good. That. Excellent. Mm -hmm. So uh, every time you come here, you tell us about your travels. You've always been. You know, you've always just come back from someplace <laughs> remarkable. Something fantastic. Yeah, yeah. So where have you been? I have been a father. So the oh. new adventure is fatherhood. So um, yeah. Every day is a trip. Every day is a trip, yeah. 
And this amazing new job that I have shoots in L.A. Oh. And my daughter just started school. Nothing shoots in L.A. anymore. I know. It's honestly, it's a miracle. I know. I was yeah. going to say, that's a miracle. And we've worked it out that I get to, I take the mornings. So, you know, the hours on TV are long, but they give me the morning so I get to get drop her off, off, drop her off at school, have that time with her in the car. It's magical. So it's amazing, too, when you just listen to what they're oh, saying. Man. What does she say? Anything interesting? Everything interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm, I, you guys know this. It's this beautiful moment that happens when they're not just your baby anymore. And suddenly they're getting all these influences. And I don't know where all these beautiful ideas are coming from. But we were in the car the other day. And we're driving to school. And she's big into Tangled right now. Mm -hmm. and so she's working through the moral dilemma of Mother Gothel. <laughs> and she tells me, Daddy, I don't think angry people are angry because they're mean. I think they're angry because they're sad. Oh. Like, okay, little girl, tell me, what, like, where did that come from? Yeah. It's like, yeah, I just feel like they don't know how to use their words, and they probably just need a hug. Oh. I'm like, yeah. Like, I almost crashed the car because I wanted to cry. Yeah, of, course. <laughs> like, of course. Who are you? Right. Whose child is this? That's yeah, amazing. It's just magic, and and it's every day just some new beautiful thing pops up. Do out you of find her. yourself? I mean, with our kids, we found the same thing. Do you find yourself getting emotional, more emotional now? Oh my. I don't think people tell men enough, like, get ready to cry a lot, or yeah. at least be choked up a lot. Because, they, they, like, things like that, it's just so beautiful, and, and each transition, and, and you guys know this, that, like, I put, I put a baby to bed that I'm never going to meet again. And there's yeah. that heartbreak at the end of every day, and I'm so excited to meet the next one, but God, I miss everyone that's come before. It's right? So yeah, it just grows so fast yeah. and every day. Yeah, I get choked up right now. Has, has she seen any of your early work? <laughs> like, has she seen the Mighty Ducks? Mm, I tr so, Disney Plus is big in my family. Yes, right yeah, of course. So, we're going to uh, watch The Lion King, which is the heavy rotation movie right now. <laughs> yes. And the title card for one of the Ducks movies popped up. And so, I'm like, hey, recognize anybody on screen right now? She looks at me, she's like, no. <laughs> Really take a look. Take a is anybody? Is he, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Recognize that guy. He looks like you, but just right. anyway. So we're looking at it, and she is like, "No, I don't." I'm like, "Just really take a look." No, no. Like, this daddy. She's like, "Oh, daddy." I was like, "Yeah, this daddy made a movie. Remember, I told you I do make believe for a living." I'm like, okay. I was like, "Would you like to watch?" No. <laughs> <laughs> so that's about as far as I've got right. so far. Um, have you figured out Halloween yet for her? Like, what is she, do you know what she's going to dress Today up as? Today is Blue Butterfly. Okay. Right, but that's going to change. But that's going to change. You, you, so, as you know. Yeah, I have a, I have a, um, I have a mermaid on hold just in case. Good. We got Blue Butterfly ready to go, but she'll tell me when we get close. Very to smart. <laughs> Always have one. Have, Gotta have a backup. It's yeah. so funny. I was just uh, cleaning out some stuff in our house, and um, I found the. We had this. Um, like a, a, a chest of drawers. Right. The costumes oh, the from costume. yeah. Halloween's past. And when you hold them up, and you cannot see. believe that you mm -hmm. had wow. kids that wore <laughs> this. Yeah. You know, it's, it's, it, it yeah. gets away from you fast. So yeah, cherish the these fast. moments. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're gonna, when you open that drawer, you're going to cry. Right. Yeah, you're right. going to cry. Yeah. <laughs> I'm prepared. All right, all right, we're going to take a break. When we come back, we'll talk about working on a luxury cruise ship. Stick around. Sounds like the dream. That's amazing. Still ahead on live. You won't want to miss the fantastic cruise ship. Yep. Uh huh. Tell With us the about it. Beautiful Philippa yes. Sue, as you saw right there. Uh huh. So yeah, it's a, it's the new show from Ryan Murphy. We're on this beautiful, beautiful boat. We have these incredibly luxurious sets. We're all dressed to the nines. And it is romance and drama and all the madness that you would expect from a Ryan Murphy show. And hopefully a positive, like, joyful experience, sure. right? The, the idea of this show, you know, he, his imagination is pretty crazy. Right, yes. right. He has all these dark shows, uh -huh. and then he also has the lighter side, and we're, we're one of his lighter side shows. So the hope is that even with all the medical drama and all the, the things that are going on, you leave the hour feeling... <sighs> I mean, that show, or a show like that, The Love Boat, was, like, such a big oh part gosh. of our yeah. well, growing up. You know... One of the things that I'm learning about Ryan and that I love about the way that he approaches all of his shows, he writes from the position of a person who loves television. Right. Who grew up with all of those shows, right? Mm -hmm. There's nothing snobby about the way that he approaches it. So 
you know, it is a very, in its way, earnest show that reminds me of the, yeah, the shows that we grew up watching where you sat down with your family for an hour That's and you just got transported. That's how families travel. Yes. Yes. Yes, totally. Yeah, and I also love, for our show in particular, because it looks so fancy, right? It looks great. And you, it's like, it's a world that, that I've certainly never been in, that most people don't, but, but the whole premise of the show is everybody is welcome, right? Mm -hmm. Everybody gets to come on board, and when you're here, you're family. And you play the hot, young, single doctor. <laughs> She so said it, not me. Does your does your character find love on this ship? I mean, What's he looking course. for? What he's looking for is to he. So the beginning of Dr. Bankman's story, which happens before the show starts, we've all gone through it, right? He was in, he was a doctor during COVID, and we've all gone through our moment yes. in COVID. He had a very very bad bout with COVID, like a very touch and go. And when he came out, decided I need to I need to go I need to change my life. So that's where we meet him. He's decided to stop what he was doing before, and he's going to go and live this crazy life on a cruise ship. And what he's actually looking for is family, right? So yes, there's romance, and there's kind of a, a brotherly relationship that I have with Chantil, and then there's a father-son relationship that I have with Don Johnson. Um, but he finds himself as part of this, yeah, this very wait, handsome family wait, wait. here. And Don Johnson plays the captain of the yes. ship? Yeah. Of course he does. Of course he does. Oh, come on. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and he's spectacular. Right. <laughs> you know, you've traveled so much for work. You've been here. You've been there but to be on a show that shoots in Los it's, Angeles it's magic it's it's, it's magic yeah. Yeah, well, we wish you well. Thank you. You know, really and it's, su it. it's such a good-looking no. cast, but I have to say, if you've ever been on a cruise ship, they uh, I'm, they hire good-looking people. <laughs> yes. It's like it's, it, they want you to enter into a fantasy world. So it is, it's yeah. actually very spot-on casting, So I you're think. saying I'm typecast? Yes. Okay. Yes. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Welcome back. All of our bargains are at least 50% off, and you can do that by just simply pointing your smartphone camera at the QR code in the corner of your screen to purchase anything you see so let's get shopping with Monica Mangan. Monica. Hi, honey. Hi. Monica and I are discussing decorating the house for Halloween we were. so we were having an off-camera conversation on camera. Yes we were. Um, all right what do we so, have here? All right partner with Great Brands as always this is Ricky Loves Ricky. There's a reason we keep talking about red light therapy it's because it works it's amazing so what we love it looks so good what we love about this one is that it has red light and blue light. So red light helps with anti-aging, fine lines, wrinkle, rejuvenates your skin. Ooh. Blue light helps get rid of bacteria and helps with acne prone skin. Mm. But what we have here is we have purple light. So it's a little blue and a little red combined together. So that gives you the boost that you want for both. So you can toggle through. I also really like this because it would be very easy to pack and take with you. Yeah, portable. It's, it's portable Very for sure. Portable. 10 minutes a day and you are good to go. Your skin is I will, really going to love it. I and will pay for this one off. since my makeup is off. Oh, it's... Okay, yes, yeah, sorry about that. 50% <laughs> off, you said? 50% off. Amazing, oh, okay. I love it. Okay, number seven, beauty. So this is one of the UK's most popular beauty lines and skincare lines. And what we have today is a lot of anti-aging and sun damage products. So okay. sun damage doesn't just happen when you're, you know, baking in the sun on vacation. It's Every single day, we're getting sun damage. So this is the day cream mark. Put a little of this on your hand and feel just how smooth it is. Wow. This has a, an SPF in it, SPF 25, and it also has peptides that basically are like rejuvenating and helping your skin. Mm -hmm. Will help with dark spots and all of that. And then we have three other collections that are available as part of our bargain. One of them is their Pure Retinol, which is awesome. We love the retinol. Okay, great. All right. Excellent. with Coco Floss and this was just named best floss by like GQ magazine real simple allure like everybody's talking about what should I floss on TV you is that should gross floss on TV. okay taste the flavors so I love the flavors this is like we have gelato affogato we have what? banana literally you have to taste that one Hold I got banana, so yummy. banana daiquiri taste this one it tastes like dessert it literally yeah, does now that's what I'm using it doesn't just taste good it was designed mm. Really good, yeah. right? Mm. It was designed by a dentist, and what it has is it has like 500 different filaments that really pulls the plaque off of it, your you teeth. You can feel it. And it it's a just difference. a comfortable, easy glide. We uh -huh. also have a toothbrush, so if you're not an electric toothbrush person, feel how soft this is. Ooh, it has I thousands love this. of soft bristles in there, so it's really good for sensitive teeth. Okay. That's delicious.
It is it's going to be weird if I wind up eating floss. Is that a weird snack? <laughs> it's weird. Yeah, it's one of those, yeah. like, food issues yeah, exactly. people have, right? Okay, so Dermaflash. We've had this before. It's a huge fan favorite. This is for dermaplaning. Uh -huh. And what that does is it's going to get the old dead skin cells off your skin. It's going to get rid of the peach fuzz. And not just, I mean, I wouldn't do it right now. Right, I'm wearing Not makeup. just so that it feels smooth, but it also helps all your products to absorb better into your mm. skin. So you're using the number seven beauty products. You've I'm just taken, you're just, just, just a little, little, just a little, little wrist hair. Yeah. It feels really good, easy to use. And we also have the refill packs this time. So if you bought it on Last Bargain and need the refills, those are 50% off. Yes, right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's very, very, feel that. Right As there. it turns out, I'm very hairy. <laughs> Thank you, Galman. Ooh, what's this? Okay, this is London Town. So this is that clean, so it's clean nail product. So instead ah. of having to get a gel manicure, which isn't the most, they're well right. toxic, right? Mm -hmm. This is clean beauty, but it doesn't chip. So it's really, their lacquer really lasts, but you can do it at home. Yeah, because your nails always look beautiful. Well, I think yours do too. But um, I like that it's clean. And also we have cuticle oils. So part of like having nice nails is thinking about the cuticle. You have to maintain your cuticle. Have and to I, and, and it. And we don't do it, but and it's so important. It really? is, and in this yes. really, really, really yeah. yeah, especially for yeah, because you're too. always like picking at your cuticles. We have a ton. Nice yeah, feel it. That's nice. That's good, right? Nice. We have a ton of colors, and then we also, if you want to do a pedicure at home, have a whole foot line as well. Oh, nice. All right. Okay. Oh, now this. Rinna Beauty. Yes. Yes. So this is Lisa Rinna's entire line here and not just lips now she's introduced eyes Incredible. okay so these kits come so this is 100% ve vegan cruelty free products and you know <gasps> she's known for her beautiful lips right we have lip plumping mm -hmm. the lip kit comes with the lipstick it comes with a liner so it's three different items in there and then for the eyes you have a smudge stick you have the mascara and the four different colors so really great gift packages and yeah. I like we have a lot of good colors for fall this stays on so nicely. I wear I have, it every day. I have it on right mm -hmm. now. It's great. And also the plumping products are great. So if you want those like really full Yeah, they give you that lips, like a uh, little tingle. Yeah, tingle. It's great. So right. I don't know if you're like me, but if it tingles, I think it's worth it. These terrific bargains are exclusively available to you, our viewers. <laughs>
Đứng vô đây nè Chứ nó không đánh chúng mình đánh nó Này giống như chiêu này giết hai thằng luôn nè Ủa, 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 ủa 